The military wives choir are continuing to take the music industry by storm and as if the Christmas number one wasn't enough, they've now been nominated for a Brit Award. They are up against Adele, Ed Sheeran and Jessie J for the best British single. Tickets for troops have 200 seats for uh, personnel on the night and BFBS Radio's Charlene Guy joined the stars on the red carpet at last night's launch party. And just a warning that this report contains some flash photography. It's been a whirlwind few months for the wives from Chivana and Plymouth since their husbands headed off to Afghanistan and choir master Gareth Malone came into their lives. And last night, their success reached another level with a nomination at the Brit Awards. They're up for Best British Single. Uh, it's just phenomenal. I can't I'm believe not allowed it. to tell anybody. So um, all, all the, the choir are practicing tonight, we're both in Chivana and Plymouth, and they're all singing away, and they've got absolutely they no idea where anything we about are. They're wondering where we are. <laughs> they've got some tough competition in this category from the likes of Adele, Ed Sheeran and JLS. Oh, I want to say, you know, we're big fans of them as well. Yeah, you know, obviously, yeah. you know, the single was, was, you know, massive this year's Christmas number one. And, uh, you know, obviously it raised a lot of money for a fantastic charity. And, you know, military wives, you know, it's fantastic. It's one of the biggest nights in the music industry's calendar. And this year's Brit Awards are going to be on at the O2 Arena in London on February the 12th. Here at the launch party, some of the nominations are out in flow who are going to be performing on the night. And Tickets for Troops have, has an integral part of this year's performance with over the 200 personnel going to be in the audience. I think for the guys to see Jesse J, Blur, JLS, so many people, they're going to have so much fun and I'm really excited for them. So they have to go online, ticketsfortroops.org.uk and register to try and get the tickets. I think they deserve to be there probably more than I do to be honest. Yeah, I think that's all I've got to say on that. Many of the acts are excited to be performing in front of the military attendees and one already has some experience. I actually went out to Germany recently. Um, nobody knows because I didn't take a bunch of press out with me like certain other people have. Um, yeah, I went out to Germany to perform for the seventh grade. Um, I had a wicked time out there. That was pretty nerve-wracking, but, but they, they came to life and they gave me a really warm welcome. But some of the mums in the Military Wives Choir have to do their research before they come back. Have you seen <laughs> sat with ricicles or, or rice cakes or R rizzle cakes? Rizzle cakes. <laughs> right. Apparently Stop they're huge, them. and I'm going to be in so much trouble by my daughters because I don't have a clue. The Brit Awards will be on BFBS One next month. Charlene Guy forces news at London Savoy Hotel.